Hey guys, what's going on today? Here it is Fat Matt, and today we're going to be discussing some Call of Duty Black Ops 5 Zombies and Call of Duty 2020 in general. So as most of you guys know, Jason Mundell has recently been let go of track, or he quit, or whatever you want to say. But recently, I've been, you know, watching a lot of YouTube videos of the guys in the Zombies community. I've been scrolling through Twitter a lot, and I'm just really, really excited for Black Ops 5 and COD 2020, because if there's one thing that's consistent about this community, while well, the people that are still in it and are confident and you know consistent and all those great things is that they believe black ops 5 is going to be great they're saying don't lose help just because jason mondal is gone i recently watched mr tlex 5's latest video and he pretty much said that we really don't know who the new head of the Treyarch zombies team is going to be and that's really really exciting and i feel like he said he believes it's going to be lee ross and Blundell leaving right now was just a marketing strategy like he really did leave a year ago when it was leaked and everybody was like oh jason got fired you know, that was real, but Treyarch didn't want that to be known, so they retracted that statement and said, hey, 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 he's not fired, that's a rumor, and now they officially make Jason Blundell leave, or just choose to announce it now, or he really threw the towel in, or he threw the towel in months ago, and they're just deciding to release that information now, but as I reminded you guys a couple weeks ago, we are getting that Black Ops 5 reveal sooner than later, it should be this month, you know, honestly, it could be within the next week, but it depends how far in the development cycle they are, but they could like just imagine this guys it's a Treyarch tweet or a YouTube video it's a black thing and the title is just Black Ops 5 reveal it fades to the screen it's like Lee Ross and he's like hey I'm gonna be the head of Black Ops 5 zombies this year watch this trailer and it's just like black ops 5 zombies mega fuck fest that would be the coolest thing ever excuse my language but i'm getting really excited for this this game like i'm just hyped man because i know there's still a lot of passionate people in the community i know it's going to be great for the people that really want it to be i don't see jason Blundell leaving as a bad thing i mean yes it's really sad and i love Blundell to death man the best game developer or the best head of developer studio that i've ever seen in my whole life he brought so many memories and so many great things to this game but sometimes change is good especially in video games and i feel like black ops 4 just took so much from him mentally and physically and he was just so drained that maybe it's healthy for him to move on as well so you know it's just really exciting and then lex tweeted something about juggernaut coming back and that just gives me absolute chills like imagine you just get lee ross in a trailer and he's like hey we're bringing juggernaut back or like him and craig houston or just craig houston or they could bump up somebody else from treyarch just anyone, man. I'm just excited to find out who it is. I'm glad that we have excitement this year. I'm excited for a zombies reveal. I'm excited for a title reveal. I'm excited to see who the new, like, PR head of Triarch is going to be. This is exciting news. I mean, this is all just so new and so crazy. And you got people speculating, is there going to be a new storyline? Are they just going to reboot Aether? Are they going to continue chaos? No one really knows. So it's all just pure speculation. So what I want you guys to do is comment down below who you think the new head of Triarch is going to be. What you think the storyline is going to be and what you think the title of the game is going to be so i'm going to go with black ops the head is going to be lee ross and i believe it's going to be a soft aether reboot i said that really weird it's going to be a soft ether reboot juggernaut's back baby new crew maybe or we could see the old crew meet in a completely different fashion i think that would be awesome let's say rick toffin's teaching at a school dempsey is uh fucking i forgot what he said he wanted to do but they're all living their own personal lives pursuing their dreams and a zombie outbreak happens and they all come together for a different reason man i'm telling you that would be so cool or it could be something in the aether universe so we get some callbacks but it's a new crew new story all that new good stuff now that's pretty much all i have to talk about i'm still just you know really excited for black ops 5 i do have a couple videos in the works some more ranking videos a little bit more top fives and just more speculation about black ops 5 now we are putting zombies chronicles 2 to rest that's done for it has pretty much been confirmed that it's dead i'm sorry but that is pretty much it for Chronicles 2. Now we could just be excited about Black Ops 5. And this is it, man. After this summer, it's going to be COD time again. And even in the summer, we're going to be getting leaks, reveals, and all that good stuff. So if you guys enjoyed today's video, leave a like, drop a comment, subscribe. Here are the members on the channel. Thank you guys so much for being a member. I really do appreciate that. It costs a dollar or two to become a member and take that extra step to support me if you really wanted to. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Thanks for watching.